Hi, I'm Stephanie Vitorino with Exercise TV, and this is your six round slim down. Six five minute rounds of strength, cardio, and core. That's right, everything that you need to slim and tone the entire body from head to toe. All you'll need is a mat, two sets of hand weights, and a medicine ball for this workout. Make sure that you have some water and a towel handy. You're gonna need it. Are you ready to get started? Take the feet out nice and wide. Let's start with the warm up. Reach up to the right, then the left. Really stretch the side body long. That's it. Now twist side to side, right to left, and pivot on that hip. You've got four more. Squat right, left. Sit into the hips. Keep the chest nice and lifted as you press through the heels. Now bob and weave, get low to get high. That's it, use those legs. Let's take it from the top, add double arms this time, really reach. You got it, give me four more, come on, let's go for it. Twist side to side, add a little power. Four more, squat side to side. Stay low this time, really sit deep into the heels. Give me one more. Now take that bob and weave. Add a cross punch all the way across the body. Let's try that again from the top. Double arm reach all the way up. Come on, really push. Four more. Back to that twist. Add a little power. That means I need a little air under your feet. Let's go. Squat, get low, stay low. Woo! Really warming up the lower body here. Bob and weave, add that punch. That's it, four more. Now lunge to the right and stretch up over to the right. That's it, sit into that right heel. Now keep this leg really long. As you sit into the heel, good. Now can you get a little lower? Reach for the toe, that's it. Now brace your core, and each time you lunge, I want you to feel that glute right there, press through it. Twist, side to side, right knee comes up. Come on, twist. Good, give me four more. You got three, two, one, pull. That's it, two more. Good, lunge to the left side. Sit into the heel, stretch all the way over. Ah, good, use this as a nice warm up for the side body, but really to warm up those legs. Reach for the toe. So just bend as much as it feels comfortable today. But the lower you get, the more you work. Just think about that. You got it. Give me that twist. Three, two, left knee. Come on, draw that knee right up to the chest. That's it, come on. You can do it. Two more. Last one. Great job, march it out. Let's take it to your mat. We're going to an elbow plank. So let's set this up with our elbows right underneath the shoulders. Now, modification. Place your knees to the floor. Otherwise, come up on the balls of the feet. Draw your shoulders back. Brace your abs in tight. Hold that plank. Feel the whole entire body start to heat up. You got it. Now press the right hand to the mat, then the left hand. Now lower down to the forearm again, to your low plank. Try it with me. Right hand, left. Lower down. Let's try that four times, a little bit quicker. Walk. That's it. Come on. Remember that modification. Take it if you need it. One more. You got it. Now hold a high plank here. Draw the abs in tight, shoulders are down. Let's add our taps to the side. Right leg comes out to the side of the mat, then left. You got it. Four more here. Almost there, four. Come on, really lift that knee as high as you can, right to the shoulder. Beautiful. Walk the legs in, hands to the thighs. Roll up the body, roll the shoulders back. Let's gear this up. Come on, 
We gotta slim down. Good. Nice work. Give me a little jump rope. You got it. For eight, seven, six. Come on. Four. Let's go to round one. Let's do it. Light hand weights. I'm using five pounds. We're gonna start with the upper body, then we'll add the lower body. Feet are right under the hips. Draw your shoulders back. Now front raise, palms face towards each other. Draw back, squeeze your triceps. Good, inhale, exhale. So we're working the front and the back of the body. Now we're gonna add on here. As the weights come back, lift your heels. I want you to work those calves right there. No muscle, left untouched in the slim down. Squat for me right here. Good, keep the chest lifted. Good, make sure those knees stay behind the toes and pull the belly in tight. Brace it. Come on, push through the heels. Put it together, arms and legs. Sit low, press high. You got it. Woo! I know this is tough. I'm right there with you. Come on, really work. Sit low, press high. Can you do four more? Let's do it. Good. You got three more left. I want you to really sit low, right here. Exhale, press. Good. Last one. Hold your triceps. Press it back. Press it back. Woo! You feel that? Come on, back in the arms. Really tone up here. You've got four left. Three, two, one. Step touch right to left. Let's go. Let's go. Good. Now this is your cardio. We want to get the heart rate up. So that means we got to work into those legs. The big muscles in our body help us burn lots of calories. Come on, really step touch. Now tap that toe behind you. As you step out, reach the opposite leg back. Those weights are gonna add an extra challenge. Okay, stay low. Are you feeling strong? Let's reach the arm right across. Good. This is your skater with weights. But I want you to really pull the abs in to support the body. Can we do four more? Three, two, great job. Put one weight down. Ready for core? Take the weight right in front of the chest. Put the feet right underneath the hips. And I want the weight to come right in front of the forehead. Exhale, draw straight down to the hips. That straight line is your pattern. Draw from here, down. Exhale. That's it. Good, pull those abs in tight. Bring your shoulders down and pull them back. Good, now try side to side right here. Right to left. Stay within the shoulders so that you really challenge the core. Nothing else moves, just that weight. You got it, you got it. Right shoulder, left hip. Diagonal, diagonal. Good, notice how my hips and shoulders stay stable as I move that weight. That's really gonna challenge the muscle. Left shoulder, woo! I don't know about you, but I'm feeling slim already. Let's go, four more. Come on, really challenge it, two more. Right here, now draw a circle, right to left. Stay within the top of the head to the hips and inside of those shoulders. Exhale. Doing great. Come on, two more. Change the direction. Go to the left, all the way up and around. All the way up and around. You got it. This is your last four, come on. Brace the abs in tight. Pull the belly button into the spine. Last one. Great job. Round one is done. You know what that means. Let's move on to round two with another strength, cardio, and core. 
We'll use a medicine ball for this next one. So go ahead and grab your medicine ball. We're gonna take lateral lunges side to side, starting right. So press through the heel as you sit the hips back. Good, make sure that you're keeping those shoulders nice and pulled back and your back nice and straight. Nice work, hold center for a shoulder press and then triceps behind the head. Pull it back in, try it again. Good, so we're toning the shoulders and the triceps here. Our knees are soft and our abs are in tight. Let's try this four more times. Take it up, pull back. Nice work. Great upper body toning right here. I need two more. Come on, really make it work for you. One more. Now lunge to the right, hold to the right for seven more. Come on, really push through that leg. Are you feeling it? Come on, really work, get lower. Two more. Now hold this for balance. Add your shoulders, triceps, release back in. That's it. So we're just lifting that right foot right off the floor. And what that's gonna do is help us engage our core so we work the entire body. I need four more. Come on, really work. Good, that standing knee is nice and soft. This is it, two more. Come on, pull in. Place the foot down, lunge to the left. Sit into the hip. Come on, the more you get low, the more you work that leg. So I want you to really push off. Last two, make them count. Hold for balance, press up, triceps. Woo! Heart rate's coming up a little bit. Now it's okay if you lose balance here. You can always tap the foot down and come right back to it. Let's try four more, come on, really work. That's it, doing great, stick with me. We got this, last two here. Squeeze up, one more. Let's hit our cardio, heel digs, right in front of the body, stay light on the feet. That's it, come on. As much air as you want to put into this, let's do it. Come on, leave the floor, you got it. Now slow this down and add a row to the side. Good, right and left. Range of motion, just keep it nice and tight here, but keep your chest up. Come on, use those legs. Four more. Ski hop, front to back. That's it. Alternate those legs forward and back, but stay nice and low. You have eight more. Doing great. Hang in. Let's slow this down. Single, single, double. Hold it here. That's it. You got it. Come on. Doing great. Slimming down. That's the key. Come on. Last one. Hold here. Jack the legs out. Stay nice and light. Now, we're gonna add the ball to this. Push it forward. Push. Good job, come on, stay with it. Press the ball over the head. You have eight left. Six. Come on. You got it. Great work on that cardio. Woo! Heart rate's up. Let's take it to the mat for our core. Have a seat. Gently roll down one vertebrae at a time. Bring the ball over the head. Give me a crunch here. Raise your shoulders off the mat, but keep that ball just above the head. Exhale. Give me two more. Now a little change. Come up and hold to a V-sit. Release. Feet and shoulders come up at the same time. Exhale, hold. Good. One last challenge. You can do it. Straighten out the legs. That's it. Exhale. So choose where you want to be today and really work. Can you do one more? Woo! Awesome work. That was round two. I think we should move on to round three. What do you say? Another strength in cardio? Let's take the ball back and grab one heavy dumbbell. This next move is a kettlebell-inspired move. It's 
a lot of power, a lot of strength. You're gonna love it just like I do. Toes are forward, hip width apart, draw the shoulders back. Now, we're gonna be squatting to the hips first. We'll add the upper body later. Give me your squat. As you squat, press through the heels. Feel the power that you have in the lower body. I want you to use that as you let that dumbbell swing forward right here. Raise up. Each time you exhale, braces the core. Nice. Catch and absorb that momentum. Power. Let's try eight more. Come on, really use it. Good. Kettlebell training is really effective for the entire body. Slims down. You got it. Hold your squat here. Come up. Nice. Come on, get a little bit lower. Sit into the heels. I need four more. Three. Stick with me, you got it. Back to your swing. Here we go. Power. Woo. Nice work. Now, in four more, I'm gonna give you a little change. As the weight comes up, step your right leg in. Right here, to the left. This is your side to side swing. Woo! It's a challenge, I know. I know you can do it. Stick with me. Hold center. Swing center for eight. Seven. Come on. Get low. Push. Breathe. I need four more. Three. Make sure you're pressed through those heels. Hold for your squat. Last four. Three, two, awesome work, woo! Cardio, like we need it, right? Bring that weight down, come back to cardio. Give me a little shuffle, side to side. Woo. Now I want you to imagine your body slimming down right now. Remember, you're on your six round slim down, we gotta work. Give me a jab, that's it. Step into it. Breathe. I need four more. Doing great. Come on, stick with me. Now give me the cross. That back hand comes forward. Now notice my back leg. I'm using a little power right there. Feel that in the core? You got it. Now hook and uppercut. Hook, upper, punch. Punch. Keep this tight. Keep this tight. Come on. Use your entire body. Good. Put it together. Jab, cross, hook, upper. Come on. You got it. Can you give me four more? Four. Three. Two. Back to your shuffle. Ah. Woo. Try that other side. Set it up. Give me your jab. Now, I want you to think like a boxer. Put your game face on. Get tough. Come on. Put your body into it. Now cross. Good, remember that back leg. Power. Give me eight more, come on. Seven. Six, five, four. That's it. Hook upper. Keep it tight. Keep it tight. You got it. I need eight, seven, six, five. Can we put it together? Jab, cross, hook upper. Come on. You do it. You can do it. Four more. Come on. Woo! Stick with me. Last one. Nice work. Let's grab our medicine ball for the last piece of core in this round. Have a seat. Same position. Shoulders are down. I want you to twist side to side and tap that ball to the floor. Now, you notice how everything we do, we're using the core here. 
that's gonna help us to slim down that body fat. Really get rid of it. Come on, exhale, new move. Toss the ball up and catch. Now, I want you to absorb that energy as it comes down right there. Feel your abs work. Exhale, doing good. Back to your twist for four, three, toss for two, absorb. One more time, four, three, toss. Come on, one more. Yes, we did it. Let's move on to round four. Let's take it back up. Grab your light set of hand weights. So place that medicine ball down. We're gonna be working the back of the body on this round. Hinging forward at the waist, working the back. I want you to give me a row and fly. So elbows come in and out. Now the entire time, you wanna pull your abs in so that you're bracing your back and keeping it nice and straight. You've got four more here. Really wrap your shoulder blades around your spine, right there. Do you feel it? Nice job, two more. This is your last one. Now send the weight all the way over to your right foot, send your left leg back. This is your single leg deadlift. I want you to hinge at the waist, let the weights carry you down, press through the heel to get up. Try it again. Let's go for four more. So trying to get the torso parallel to the floor is the goal, but only go to where you can really feel it in the glute and use the hamstring. This is your last one. Let's try the other leg. Left side takes the weight, right leg goes back. Brace your core before you hinge. Now, weight send forward. Draw through the glute. You're doing great. We've got four to go. Nice work. Good. So you always keep that standing leg slightly bent. Last two. Feel the glute work. We're gonna put this together with your row and fly. Take a row and fly. Nice. I need two more. Come on, let's really work the back of the body here. Last one. Send the weight to the right leg. Hinge forward. Draw straight up. I need two more. Exhale here. One more. Good, row and fly. Yes, we got it. Come on, really working the back of the shoulders. Good, great for posture. You got it. Send the weight to the left leg. Hinge forward. Squeeze through the glute to get up. You've got two more to go. Come on. Inhale, exhale. Nice. Let's try this one more time. Row and fly. So now that you know it, I want you to really focus on working the back of the body here. Last one. Come on, you're doing great. Stick with it. Right leg hinges forward. Draw straight up. Good. Exhale up. I need two more. Good, really stretch that leg long. Good, back to your row and fly. This is your last set. Come on, you got it. Good, make sure you exhale every time you lift. That's it. One more. Good, let's work that left side. Hinge, squeeze up through the glute. Really make it work for you. Great job, I need two more. Come on. Lift tall. Great job, let's move to cardio. Put those weights down. Come back to center. Good. Nice and light. Nice and light on the feet. Great job. Work here. Now take it to a jack. Here we go. Arms up. Nice. So bend those knees so you really use the muscle here. I need eight, seven, six, Come on, four, right leg, lunge it back. Down with the knee up, down with the knee up. Two more like that. 
Now take that knee to a kick. Heel, strikes. You got it. Two more. Back to your jack. Center it out. You got it, come on. Really work. I need those arms to get up there. Eight, seven. Doing great. Come on. Here we go with your left leg. Lunge it back, knee strikes. You got it. Here's your last one. Try that kick. Strike. Flex the foot, almost like you want to push. Last one. Jack. You got it, come on. Stick with it. Four more. Lunge back with the right. Two knees. Give me two kicks. Right here. Jack center. For eight, this is your last round. Come on, you got it. Four. Left leg, take it back. Two knees. Two kicks. Nice work, yes. Woo. Core's next. Let's take it to a plank position. Woo, I gotta catch my breath. Here we go. Hands underneath the shoulders. Take it to the toes. This is your high plank. Hold this here. Hold. Draw and brace your belly in. Now right and left knee tap the floor, right at the chest. Right at the chest. Doing great. Breathe. Good. Nice. Now, hop this in. Both feet. Both feet. This is an option. Take it if you like. It's really challenging, but I know you can do it. Come on, two more. Tap it out to the side. Right here. Side. Good. We have one set here with the hop. Think about slimming down that waistline, working hard for it. You can do it. Hop to the side and center. Hop. That's it. You can keep the taps if you choose. Last four. Three. You got it, two. And one. Woo! Hands come back, roll it up. Great job on round four. I'm feeling it. I hope you are too. Let's go to round five. Grab your medicine ball. Strength section. Lunge forward. Alternate legs. So you're going right to left. And I want you to keep that knee behind the toes. Hold the ball right at the chest. You're doing great. Stick with it. Slow down the lunge and rotate to the right. Pull back, try it on the left side. Exhale. Woo! We never slow down. We keep it going. You got it. Come on, four more. Get low. Strong legs. Strong core as you twist. One more on each side. That's it. Woo! Now lunge this back. Rear lunge. Now on a rear lunge. Focus on that front leg and push straight up. That's it. Two more. Slow this down. Chop. Good, this is your pullover. Lunge. I want you to imagine your back expanding and contracting right there. Four more. Exhale. Woo! I'm feeling it. Oh, we need one more on each side. Come on, stick with me. You've got it. That's it. Cardio time. Ball comes back. Let's take a little march. March it out. Big march, big march. That's it. Woo! Are you ready to pick this up? Run for me. Come on, run. That's it. We're almost there. Hang in. This is round five. Remember, you only got one more to go. Come on, give me a little more energy. Burpee, hands to the floor, hop back, and in, press up. Now, if you need to modify this, you can take it slower. That's up to you. Really work. Four to go, 
come on, four. Ah, uh, that's it. I need two more. Brace that core really tight. Back to your run. Eight, seven, six. All I want is four more burpees. Here we go, four. Let's go, let's go. Woo. Two more, come on. One more. Oh, nice work. Grab your medicine ball. The core section is a wood chopper. So I want you to stand with your feet shoulder width apart. Draw your shoulders down. Now the ball is gonna come across the body and up. Squat down, place the ball to the floor to the right. Twist and lift to the left. Here we go. Yeah. Seven. Six. Five. Good. Squeeze your abs. Two more. Try it on the left side. Down. Twist. Now, you pivot on that opposite leg right there as you twist. Two more. Woo oh, great job on round five. Let's move on to round six. Put your medicine ball down. Grab your light weights. We made it to our last round. Let's take the feet out wide. We're gonna go into a clean and press. So I want you to use the weights here in front of the body and the hips to drive the hands up with a little power. So you release up to the shoulders, push through the legs to press. Now you're gonna notice here that you gotta break the weights through to get them down there. But I want you to absorb that power through the legs. Push, you've got four more, you're doing great. Press through, that's it. Good, so it's a little curl and a press. Reverse curl here, last one. Great job, release the weights down, turn to the right, hinge at the waist and bring the elbows right by the sides of the body. Give me a tricep kickback right here. Nice, so keep those elbows really close with a slight bend in the elbow as you press back. That's it, doing great. Last four, really squeeze the tricep here, two more. Back to your clean and press. Center it down, clear it, and press it up. That's it. Now that you know the move, I really want you to get low and use that power to push. Nice work, let's go for four more. Come on, this is a great full body workout right here. Using so many muscles to get the job done. Brace the core, last one, you got it. Exhale, great job, turn it to the left. Hinge at the waist, draw the elbows right by the body, brace the core as you kick back. Good, feel this in the back of the arms. I need eight more. Come on, really squeeze the triceps. Keep that back nice and flat. Try not to round the shoulders over. Focus on the triceps here. Two more. Great job. Woo! I think we need to move to cardio. Last round. So we're gonna work this. Give me a little boxer shuffle. This is your last boxing combo. Face the right. Go back to that jab, but walk it forward towards me. One more. Stay here. Go high low. That's it. Now walk it back. Jab. Jab. Twist those hips. Stay high low. Let's try it again. Walk it towards me. Press. Stay here. High low. Come on, sink into those hips. Walk it back. Put some body into it. High low. That's it. High knees, center, run it out. Come on, lift those knees. Woo. This is the last round. I'm gonna tell myself that again and again. So I push a little harder. Give me eight more of these. Eight, seven, come 
Come on, get them up there. Four, three, great job. Take it low. Set up for the left side. Hands right under the chin. Are you ready? Jab towards me, let's go. Use your body. Get high low, sit low. That's it, now walk it back. Twist, high low. Come on, squat low. One more time, let's do this, go. Push, you got it, come on. Woo. We're working here, take it back. Give me your high low. Last round of high knees. Take them up. Come on. If they didn't make it up there last time, come on. Get them up there this time. You got it. Let's go. Four more. Three, two, walk it out. Woo! Let's go to that core. Last core move. Grab your medicine ball. Come back to your mat for a seated position. So this one is a little toss. A little variation on the last core move that we did with our medicine ball. Lean back slightly, brace your core, hold the ball right at the chest level. Squeeze your abs in tight. Now you're just gonna toss the ball side to side, right to left. Let it leave your hands so that you have to catch it. Catch, woo, oh, doing great, hang in there. Can you lean back just a little bit more? Woo! You should feel this in the abs. I need eight more. This is your last eight. Come on. Almost there. Four, three, two, one. Ah, oh, we did it. Time for a well-deserved stretch. Take that ball out of the way. Good, come to a comfortable seated position. Just give me an inhale up with the palms. Take a deep breath, exhale it out. One more, give me an inhale up. Good, exhale it out. This time, inhale the arms up. Take the right palm down to the floor, and as you exhale, side bend. Back to center release, inhale the arms up. Try the other side, left hand down, and stretch. Let's do that one more time on each side. Inhale, exhale to the right. Good, that feels so good after a hard workout. Whew, this is my favorite part. Ah, great job, stretch those legs long in front of you. We're gonna stretch the right hamstring, so bring that left sole of the foot just inside of the thigh. Inhale those arms back up, dive forward, and reach for wherever feels comfortable here. I want you to feel a nice stretch in the hamstring and in the glute. Good, roll through to get back up. Switch sides. Right foot comes into the left thigh. Inhale up, dive forward, stretch. Woo. I know that your legs are feeling it because mine are. Those squats and lunges were tough, but they were worth it. Woo. Roll up. Good, let's take it to our knees and our hands. And then take your foot up and your knee to the ground. Bring your body up and then unroll the toes in the back and tilt your pelvic bone forward so that you feel a nice stretch in the front of that thigh. Let's lean into this just slightly. Good, that feels great. Place the hands to the floor. Come up in a high lunge. Let the hips drop. So you feel even a deeper stretch in that hip. Good, you should feel your breath coming back to normal. Nice, turn it to the front, face knee, open up the hips, feel a nice stretch in the front of the body, and release the palm all the way over to the side. Great job, release the arm. Slowly and gently walk the feet slowly back together. Come up and roll the shoulders back. Big rolls. Nice, let's take that quad stretch to the other side. Come down to the knee, untuck the toe, tilt your pelvic bone forward, and then slightly lean into the stretch. Good. Woo. That feels great. You should feel that right in front of the thigh right here. Nice stretch for the hip. 
You get really tight there sometimes. Place the hands to the floor, lift up into that high lunge. Let the hips drop. Make sure that that knee in the front is not coming over the toe. Okay, so keep that right over the ankle. Nice, and then just gently turn the angle to the front, rest your forearm on the thigh, and reach up. Feel the hips opening up, the inner thighs stretching. Gently release the arm, heel toe, come back to center. Give me a nice inhale up, exhale it out. One more, deep breath. Woo. Inhale, exhale it out. Congratulations. Thank you so much for working out with me. That was six rounds slim down. I'm Stephanie Vitorino with Exercise TV.